What's up guys? Welcome back to the Blind Box Hunt. Today I have for you is this Disney Villains box. So this is probably a lot late like all my videos. But I want to show my reaction to this. So of course I already know what's inside. Good thing about this, even though Hot Topic has been doing these, it seems so far for these Disney Villain boxes you get a movie scene from Disney so that's cool I feel like that is what most of your many of the pops go into the last one you had uh, the movie scene from Ariel from Little Mermaid you have a uh, Moana mystery mini and then you got a couple of small random things just to fill up the box but they weren't really all that great so yay and boo the boxes themselves are pretty cool they're not just you know your standard um box because they are being sent to the store they're made out of a bit of a flimsier material since they're not being sent through the mail anymore and there's more design sense to it so this one is a little box from Snow White and this is a villains box so if you remember the last villains box we got a Maleficent Dragon which was pretty cool and then this here sticker which sadly is going to die that's holding it together. It's wrapped in. That's cool. Okay. So big thing in the box is the pop. Which is, again, it's a movie moment from Peter Pan. So that's cool. This is where the bulk of the money is going to. If you know, movie moment pops go for like 30 bucks, kind of. This all together, since it's from Hot Topic, costs $32.90. So you get this, that's cool, and I actually got a little rotating thing, so hopefully I can put that on there and rotate it for you guys and give you a closer look on this, but from what I can see, it's done very well. It's cool that you get to see TikTok, the water's done very well. Here, let's take this out and show. I like, like, I like how the background is of um, the pirate ship. The puck in the water and his fire ship in the back. Came out really easily, so that's a cool thing. But like, alright, so we have Captain Hook. His legs are spread apart because he's trying not to get eaten by TikTok. I really like the sword is actually not like crazy bent like usually they are so that's really cool the hook the hand the way he is the hat even the rocks in the water like these movie moment pops are really cool i am hoping one day i can find an old uh, little mermaid box but these are actually pretty well made um the little mermaid one i actually didn't like as much because they painted on her lips and it kind of looked weird it wasn't even shaped in or anything it was just painted on so that's why I didn't get it. I bet it looked better in person than it did. So now I'm hoping that I can get the Little Mermaid one. Uh, I feel like they did a really good job on this. Just half of TikTok. If you look at the bottom, you can see it's like a pop cut in half or something. Because you can see like little holes in the bottom and stuff that keeps the shape. But yeah, this is a really nice pop. A really nice movie moments pop. Another thing you get is a pin... And mine is of Jafar. So of the Genie Jafar, Jafar pen. We get this. And then you get Diablo, which is from Maleficent. Not Maleficent, um, Sleeping Beauty, but this is Maleficent's little um, bird dude. Her little minion. It is a Hot Topic exclusive. I don't know if you can get it out of the box. Probably not. But there's that. So this is somewhat disappointing. So you do get a mystery mini, but it's not in the tins anymore. The last one was in the tin, but I guess they downgraded to this. Where you get the old mystery mini box. And there's only one mystery mini that you get in here, which is the evil, the evil witch from Snow White. The one that gives her the apple. So it's cool that we get a villain. 
but they could have pushed this a little bit more like given her the a poison apple in her hand or something like that it is in the style that um the disney princesses and the disney villain mystery minis are again i'll give you guys a closer look on the rotation but let's talk about this a little bit it's actually because there's not that much I would have kind of liked to see what would they have done if they had her in more of a crouching position because she's old and stuff in the movie. And it would have been nice to see her like with a hunched back and stuff. You can see some shape from her shoulders, her back to her her booty and then just going down to the actual cloak. But there's not really that much to comment on. They have a little wart on her face and stuff, little pointy cheeks pointy chin, some white hair, but I don't know, I feel like it needs like a poison apple or something, or maybe more of a, a more of a dynamic, dynamic pose in the mystery mini. Again, I really wish that they would have given us the tin with this, because the tins were usually like the coolest things out there, but this one didn't have a tin. Looking at Diablo, it's really cute, it's a pocket pop, it, it's a keychain. The cool thing about the this one though is um I guess all pocket pops have this. You can actually take it off of the keychain and put them on something else. So there's that. But it's a pocket pop. It's a little smaller than the mystery mini. But yeah. There's not that much to say. It is of a crow. His feet, his wings. They look like it's really nicely done and sculpted. But yeah, I feel like the most What's worth it is the movie moment. Like, this pretty much costs the box anyways. And they're just throwing in all these extra stuff. It'll be nice to... For the mystery minis, they bring back the tins. That's a big thing. It'll be nice to see the patches again. Because I really I really like those too. That, that was worth the price. And we're paying... A little bit less. But not that much. To buy it in a store. Because, uh, what was it, the boxes from Funko was about $25 plus the shipping. It came up to like 30 to 35 bucks, basically. So, it would have been nice. They could have kept the same stuff, basically. That I feel like. I mean, just give us the patch, the mystery mini, and the... With the tin, and Captain Hook. Or the movie moment, or the extra pop, or you know, the pop ride, whatever you feel like that needed to go in there. But so far, this is the second movie moment, so the boxes seem like they're going to be more movie moments. We won't know until maybe the third or fourth box, really. But yeah. I actually really like the box. It's something I would keep. Until, you know, it dies off. Even though it's more cheaply made, it's a really nice box, and I feel like it matches the theme a lot better. Um... Again, I really want to get the Little Mermaid box now. But yeah, like always guys, if you enjoyed the video, leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And what do you think of the Hot Topic Disney treasure boxes, or Disney boxes? Do you guys like them? Do you think that they could have done more because you are kind of paying the same price point, just no shipping, basically? Um, because right now, I'm not really sure... I will give it a couple more. Like these toppers. Something I'm not really into collecting. It's a pin. I don't know how well the pin is. And then like three of them. Three of these things I do really like. So the movie moments. The mystery mini. But I do wish they bring the tin back. And the pocket pop. I do miss the patch that came with every um every box. That was kind of cool. That was kind of a signature, so I really hope that they bring that back. Hopefully one day. Um, I'm thinking that they're going to be testing out new, more products in these mystery mini, in these mystery boxes. Because, like I said, the pin, they've been around for a while, but I don't think they sell all that well. Or maybe they do, I don't know. But to me, I don't really like this. And just, I really do miss the tin and the patch. I don't know why, but I really do miss those two. But I really do like the movie moments, too. But, yeah. Tell me what you guys think about the boxes. Or do you think it's worth the money that we're spending? Do you think that you kind of want, like, the old stuff back? 
Do you hate the fact that it's in a hot that they're doing exclusive to certain stores? I know the Marvel one is to Amazon. I haven't really seen any of those. I know. Yeah, Hot Topic has the Disney ones. Who has DC? I don't know. Can you guys know who has the DC boxes? The DC Legions of Collectors boxes? If you do, comment that down below because I don't know who actually has that. What store does? Is it supposed to be Walmart or Target? I don't know. But yeah. But there's that. So if you guys enjoyed the video, please blah 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 blah. blah. If you guys enjoyed the video, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next blind box hunt. Bye.